you smell what the rock is cooking. Lord Jesus, we are gathered here today because I just want to get my little rebuttal about how black folks just don't know how to act on public buses. So, what's up everybody? This is your boy Mr. Dean Brinkin, Mr. Disrespectful. You know, just coming in just to um, share my little views. You know, I thought I saw it all this year. Mm, mm, mm. I don't think I have, and 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 then the fucked up thing about it is that the year is not even over yet. So last night, let me just tell y'all, after getting done watching the presidential debate, right? Okay, I just happened to run across this little video one of my friends had posted, right? It's called, let's just go back. Um, bitch, get off my bus! Driver uppercuts the shit out of a teen girl. So even looking at the, just looking at the title alone, you know, grabbed my attention. You know, I'm not saying I like black on black crime, but <laughs> this video I have to see. So from start to finish, I don't understand black folks. I just don't understand. When you get on a bus, you are trying to go from point A to point C, B, P, whatever, and all this shit. I see this ghetto ass chick in, the, in his get up clothes and got the, the little OJ gloves and shit fussing with a bus driver. But that's not the funny thing about this whole entire video. It's that construction motherfucking guy with that high ass yep, orange coat on or whatever. I'm thinking this is a security guard, right? So. I'm guessing that he's just a passenger or whatever. So you know what I'm saying? But he was standing up the whole entire time. There are seats on the damn bus. But then yet, he's standing there and shit. And I'm just like, okay, is this a security guard? Or what's he trying to do? So, anyway, going back to the girl. The girl is cussing out the bus driver. She's not asking him, hey, uh, bus driver, you know, can I get to... Um, you know, such and such street, can I get to such a, I hear, bitch this, nigga this, then a bunch of I'm going back with her, talking about, oh, I'm going to get my, I'm going to get my niece on your ass, I'm going to get my niece on your ass, and I'm just like, why the fuck are you arguing with this, this passenger or whatever, I mean, like, what the fuck, what, what, the? but underneath it all, I would have done the same thing too, by the way, so, they going back and forth, right, okay, then he pretty much just like had the whole bus rolling saying that her face looks like it's been cut up or whatever and the whole fucking bus is just like rolling and shit and then she hits the bus driver I mean what is pineapples I mean what is this whole thing of passengers hitting bus drivers I mean, it's bad enough we had this shit happen in Milwaukee. You know, some guy just comes in and just jumps on a bus driver for, like, no apparent reason. Like, I'm going to get you, bitch. I'm going to get you, nigga. I'm going to get you. I'm going to get you. I'm going to get you what you at least expect against you. Yeah. So, this bitch. The next, the next thing I see. You going to jail? You're going to jail? You're going to jail? Boom! Show you get <laughs> Tiger uppercut! This nigga uppercuts the shit out of this bitch. Do she deserve it? Of course. But, I have to go back to what I was taught as well. My mom told me, never hit a female. No matter what she does, Never hit her. But it comes to a time when someone put their hands on you. It's open season. I don't give a fuck if you a bitch. 
nigga, transsexual, half gender, I don't give a fuck. You put you put your motherfucking hands on me, I'm going to whoop your motherfucking ass straight up in skin. You know what I'm saying? So, this bitch get up, I mean, I don't know if she had weave or whatever, but like I said, after she got uppercutted, this motherfucker did some WWE style. Took her by her fucking hair and threw her off the motherfucking bus. And whatever that little uh, pink book bag, she he tried to throw it out. But then the camera turned to the back of the bus. Then it turned back into the front of the bus. Then this bitch got up. Oh, my God. I mean, that should have been K.O. But this bitch get back on the fucking bus. And the bus driver drags her by her hair. Throws her right on the ground. And then some bitch in the background gonna talk about that's a motherfucking fear. Bitch, you were just laughing at that shit. Shut the fuck up. Then I mean, I mean, trying to get on the bitches, uh, trying to get on the damn bitches um, side. I mean, come on now, what the fuck? You know what I'm saying? That's what I understand about folks. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, you was just witnessing a domestic crime or whatever that happened on a bus, you tape recording this shit, then when the bitch got her ass whooped, then you are in the back talking about, oh, that's a fucking female, why you do that? You know what I'm saying? Then, like I said, I would have said the same thing the bus driver said. You want to be a man? I'm going to treat you like a motherfucking man. And just did just like that. I would have did the same thing too. But it's the funny thing about it, the whole thing is, and I want y'all to feel me on this. Why do black folks get on buses and act like a fucking fool? Now, this bitch should be, she probably one of them 47%, you know what I'm saying, uh, quoting uh, Mick Romney. She could have been one of them 47%, you know what I'm saying, ones that's unemployed, looking for a fucking job. Instead, she on a bus trying to get paid. And she might get paid too, because I think you know, that, that bus driver is going to get sued, straight up. You know what I'm saying? Because first of all, that's like a felon. You up there hitting, you hitting the passenger, even though the passenger did hit him. And she does deserve it. You know, show you again! You know, but still, he had no business like, you know, wow. I mean, and that was like, pfft, woo, wow. When I seen that shit, man, that shit, that video spread like wildfire all over YouTube and Facebook, Twitter, whatever you want to call it. But it's just, I don't, I don't understand why people get on these fucking public buses and act like a fucking fool. Straight up, you supposed to act the fucking bus driver. Can you let me off on this stop? Can you drop me off on this stop? Can you tell me where is the next destination at? No, 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 no. I hear, bitch ass nigga, I'ma whoop your ass. Bitch ass nigga, you gonna give me a dime for this. Bitch, you gonna let me on the bus for free. Bitch, you gonna do this. Bitch, you motherfucker, I'ma whoop your ass, motherfucking ass. I'ma get my damn this. Really? See, that's why I'm going on public buses no more. Because y'all crazy ass motherfuckers don't know how to fucking act. That's a wrap. How y'all doing? Goodbye.